All right, so on today's episode, we are checking out the difference in hyper rarity compared to silver and base of Luka Doncic. The reason why we're doing this is because the hyper has finally started to outpace the silver because there's a lot lower population. Population meaning the amount of PSA 10s in existence. So let's check it out. So I'm gonna go ahead and share my screen. So right here shows you the green line. Let's go ahead and unclick the base. I was just looking at that for my own personal sake. So the base, or not base, the silver rapidly increased. They were kind of on par. This is the data chart for the last year. They are on pace with each other around 2000. Still, the silver was more expensive. Only at one point in time was the silver less expensive than the hyper. So silver dramatically raised, dramatically, 8,000 peaked at, peaked at $10,000 on March the 13th, but has kind of went down. Not by very much, but still has went down. And population, there is 2,025 of this card available. That's a lot of silver prisms. That's a lot of silver prisms. So compared to hyper, hyper being the rare, rarer one, there is only 88 88 PSA 10 hypers, which if you look at this hyper, it has this kind of like, it has a different effect than a, it has like the silver effect, but it has like rivets in it and everything. But what's more difficult about these hypers is it has this little nasty little print line. I haven't really seen, I have like seven Kuzma hypers and I don't have a single 10. I haven't seen a single 10. Uh, I'm actually gonna pull up the pop report for the nine just for my own sake later and see how many are graded higher because I'm not sure how many PSA 10 hypers there are. So long story short, this hyper rare Luka Doncic prism rookie card is rarer than the silver. Silver being iconic, but this only has 88 available. So do I expect this hyper to go up? Maybe. Do I expect this prism to drop below the hyper as it's doing today? $7,700 on the hyper and can't even see the, show me. This one sold today for $8,400. So Hyper, if you get pick up Hyper Prisms of your favorite Ricky, then Hyper is the, is the way to go. Rarer form of, of any Prism card. One of them, besides numbered cards, numbered cards, there's only certain amounts available. So that's a whole new topic for a whole new day. I just wanted to show you the price, pricing that's happening with Luca. This is crazy numbers, crazy numbers. $8,000, $8,400 for a hyper. If you bought the hyper, if you bought the hyper right here, at $3,000, on October 21st, you've made five, jam, five Gs. That's just crazy to think about. So do your research, study what cards are rarer. The color is like what you need to go for um, is a lot lower population. So let's check this out really fast. I want to do Did my thing just freeze? 
Sorry. So let's go, let's say silver. Silver is iconic. Let's say blue ice to 99. PSA 10, because that's what people go for. Search. And this will pretty much be the same thing for any other rookie card that you have. 37. 37 PSA 10 Luka Doncic rookie cards. $68,000, $70,000. Only two have been sold in the last year. Only two. The color is the rarest thing that you can get. So if you're chasing LaMelo Ball, if you're chasing Anthony Edwards or James Wiseman or RJ Hampton or <laughs> anything of the sort, color, color, go color. You'll do better on color. And that's pretty much it. That's the video. I have another video that I have in mind for tomorrow, which is figuring out figuring out if it's worth buying basketball products to open or to just buy singles, singles, singles. So make a smart investment. The pandemic is hopefully on the last leg of its race. So, but I think that's actually going to explode the market again because this is a whole nother topic, but I think that people being in more of a social environment and being able to talk about their hobby, being able to talk about the things that they love and share it with other people and have a good time with other people that like the same thing is going to be dramatic for what's going to happen. So good luck to you. Have a great rest of your day. Leave a like, comment, subscribe if you feel like it. Take care. Have a blessed rest of your day.